Hey guys, Small Town Guy here. Um, just wanted to make a quick video to talk a little bit about these Donkey Kong power supplies that come up in conversation from time to time and people will you know, inquire as to why their game's not turning on right. Like you'll get a white screen when the game's powered on because the game board's not booting and it's because voltage isn't getting out of the power supply. And a lot of people talk about cold solder joints and uh, they, they, they try to tell you that you need to resolder the power supply, but you know, opening one of these things up can be challenging and people are not quite sure what to do. So I've actually got a power supply on the bench here. I've already taken it apart. The cover has already been removed. Um, it's really just a matter of getting the screws undone. And then once you've done that, the, uh, the supply itself has a board on two different sides and the most common areas that people see the solder joints that are bad are on the the 9, 10, and 7 pin connectors here. The, the Where they're soldered to the board, those are the most common places that you start to see the cold solder joints right up here. But this particular power supply, that's already been fixed. I took care of that a couple months ago and it started acting up again. And on further inspection I noticed there are three sets of carrier wires that move voltages off of the incoming AC board down to the board that creates the different voltages for the power supply and sends them back up. And it um, has these three connectors here that uh, move the voltages around and those connectors are the ones that are actually exhibiting the cold solder joints now. Uh, I pulled it, uh, pulled it out and set it on the bench and I have a magnifying lens with uh, a light on it and if you don't have one of these I'd highly recommend getting something like this because it really helps you to get a closer look at things that you just you can't see otherwise and I discovered that on this connector here and this one here so these two um, there are some cold solder joints and it, it's gonna be almost impossible to show it on video but rest assured they're there uh, I'll try to snap a picture with one using the uh, the SLR camera that I've got and uh, I'll put a link to it in the description of the video but I'm gonna go ahead and fix those two up and um, I'll put it everything back together and we'll give it a shot and test it out 